What's going on guys? I'm going uh, to be teaching you guys how to uh, how to dribble. This is pretty basic, something you need to learn early on. Maybe gold, low platinum. I'm going to teach you guys the basics and uh, I think I'll take you into uh, free play first. So here we go. So when you start out here, what you want to do is you want to take your car here and you want to go push the ball a little bit and then get to the side of it and start pushing around the circle. Now this may seem really redundant and stupid. This is going to help you a lot. So if you look right there, let's do nice little 360s. So you can get that down where the ball doesn't roll away from you. And eventually you can take and pop it up, just like that. That's how you're going to get on top of your car. Or you can catch it, which I'll teach you guys how to do later. And then you can do little flicks with it like that. So from here what you want to do once you get that down is take it to the side of the map here. And basically just drive with the ball on the side of your car against the wall. Now I did go a little fast there and that's what will happen if you go too fast. So you take it over here. And basically just do it like just like this. Right here. Drive real slow, take your time. That's going to give you the feel for how fast you need to drive in order to keep the ball on top of your car. basically you just keep driving keep driving do stuff like that and pop it up just like that so now I'm gonna show you if you look the balls popped up a little bit so you can just take the ball drive right into it and it'll go on top of your car no problem and you can keep doing that just keep doing that real simple shot until you know until you get used to it so here, I'm going to show you what happens when you go a little too fast. Basically what you don't want to happen is you don't want to lose control of the ball. And if the ball goes supersonic, you can't go any faster than that. So you will lose control of it, just like that. It'll roll off the front of your car, and you won't have anything to do with it. So next I'm going to show you guys a nice little training pack you can do. And uh, the code will be there, so you can use it if you'd like. Uh, here we go. So this is technically a musty flick training pack. Now, I do recommend using dribble training packs, but this one works too. You saw the code there. Pause if you need to. Um, so what you do once you get in here is you basically just want to go and make sure that you've got this dribbling down pat. This will give you the room and everything to go back and forth. If you drop the ball like that, it's just going to get rid of it. So you carry it into the goal. And basically from there, we just want to go into uh, aerial training. So you just want to go into all-star aerial training just like this. And you want to try catching the ball. Now, it's going to be a little difficult at first, definitely. Like you might start doing stuff like that, where you hit the ball too high on your car. Or you might just flat out miss it, honestly. But what you want to happen is this, just like that. And it'll stop the ball from bouncing, and you got everything you need, all the control, everything. Once you've been practicing for a while, I'd recommend going back into free play here. Just so you can take, and you can make sure all of your mechanics, everything is good to go. So the reason I like playing free play, the reason a lot of other people do, is that you're able to manipulate the game to a point where it feels like you're in an actual game. Hitting the ball places where you normally wouldn't, stuff like that. <clears throat> That's where it pops up in the air like that. And see, if you don't practice like that, you'll just miss. But, uh, yeah, once you get that down, you can get everything else down, you're uh, good to go. So if you enjoyed watching, leave a like, and I'll talk to you guys later.